Hi everyone, this is D Dee with Dee's Divine Tarot 411 and today we're going to go ahead with the Celtic Cross reading for the sign of Pisces. Pisces, you can see I'm at the beach in Hawaii. Let's give y'all a view of all the deliciousness out here. Absolutely gorgeous. And beautiful Hawaii. So, um, I'm just going to go ahead and get the shuffling going for you. Let's see if I can set y'all up with the ocean view on the side there okay and check out the rocks I got <laughs> these are my paperweights if you can see those I'm not sure if you can that is my paperweights beautiful crystals thank you Risa for all these beautiful crystals I got one from Sierra and Florida as well but the rest I think are from and I got one from uh, Tiff in, or, in uh, St. Pete as well, in Seminole, Florida. So yeah, all these beautiful rocks were given to me as gifts. So what a blessing to use them during my tarot readings. Oh, some of these cards are all twisted. So it's going to take me a little bit of a minute to get this going for y'all, but we'll get it. And I don't do reversals, so we'll just take the cards as is if they come in reversed. I'll get to that eventually just not right now okay so I don't know if y'all know I'm pretty much new to tarot I think I've been at it four months close to five and I started when my queen passed 11 months ago coming up on a year next month at the end of the month and so it's been a long road and this is why I'm here in Hawaii taking leaps of faith and making huge changes in my life we're just going to shuffle for you, Pisces. I hope y'all can see me pretty well. It looks dark where I'm... There we go. I hope y'all can see me. Okay, so... Spirit. Let's talk to Spirit. Thank you, Spirit, for everything. This luscious, beautiful day. It's beautiful women. It's beautiful men. It's beautiful babies. Beautiful animals. Just beauty all around. Beautiful water. Everything is just beautiful here. <laughs> and it's just a different way of life. It's, it's island life, so it's not the same. You have people working everything, but this is not the same rat race that, you know, most of us get up and do. This is even five hours, five to six hours behind, like, all the cities I lived in. <laughs> My main cities from Illinois to Florida. Yeah, <laughs> it's like five to six hours different so I got to keep that in mind when I'm doing these readings for you guys so you get them in a timely manner and the whole nine but okay spirit thank you so much for all these beautiful blessings today please bless these cards in this reading for Pisces please give us clarity insight and guidance and this is a timeless reading so whenever you see it it's valid for you then spirit works like that Everything, everywhere, all at once is who we are. Many parallel universes and <laughs> versions of us that we don't even realize. <laughs> but we can uncover anything if we ask the Creator for clarity, insight, and guidance. And just ask questions. Spirit will reveal to you what you need to know. Just like in these cards. So without further ado, that felt flush, spirit, we're going to cut the cards, alright Pisces, cards are cut, bottom of the deck card is, <laughs> wait, this is beautiful, even though this is a cancer card, this is God's mini, no, not mini, this is God's Uber, super Uber, coming to pick you up and take you to your next destination, so this is all 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 about <laughs> getting you where you belong and it's by the hand of the divine by god so you can't lose ever with this chariot and it's a major arcana card so this is going to give us uh, a powerful reading this is going to be a powerful reading and it's going to be quick fast moving energy you're going to be in god's uber limo <laughs> okay so i'm going to cut the cards i just wanted to show y'all that was the bottom of the deck card Five, six, one, two, three, four, five, and six. Okay. 
And then I'll do my process here, top to bottom. Three, four, five, six. Good. One more. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Six, one, two, three, four, five, four, six. Okay. So we're ready to get your reading going. Can y'all see that water back there? I hope so. All right. First card we got for you, Pisces. It's the Eight of Cups, so these go in hand in hand. You're getting out of Dodge. You're ready to leave. <laughs> Something's missing in your life. The way you got these uh, cups stacked up is showing that you're not satisfied. There's something missing in your life, and you want to fill that space, that void, in with what you're missing. So you're going after it, and it looks like Spirit has your back in this, and it's going to take you there super, super fast. You'll look back like... Wow, my whole life is completely different, and this happens so fast. That's how spirit does things, okay? So, we're going to keep it moving for y'all, Pisces. Next card we got is the Queen of Wands, so maybe this is what's missing in your life that you're going after, or maybe uh, vice versa, maybe the Queen is leaving to go find her king. But all in all, this is a blessed reading. So far, we got the queen, we got the chariot, and someone leaving to go find what they're missing. It's either going to be this queen, or this is a king for this queen. All right, so next card we got, y'all. Uh, the four of pentacles. So this is someone pent up, not really feeling their worth, not really seeing their worth, uh, holding on tight to their security. So... I know all about this. <laughs> I kind of like, I'm like this in a sense. I got to watch every penny just because money's tight and I'm only doing tarot right now. I will get back to doing teaching alternative astronomy and making these divine tarot products and stuff like that. But I haven't had the time. I'm just trying to keep afloat and keep the readings flowing for you and, you know, trying to eat <laughs> and pay my credit card bills. But I'm also looking for a home. I need a car. So I need a lot of money. But this is sometimes how we feel when we got a penny pinch and we got a, I'm taking like I get donations here and there. So I got to take those donations, throw them in my bank so I can pay my credit card bill. So sometimes, like I just got an amazing tip. Alicia, you helped me so hugely. My credit card bill is due in a couple days and you helped me with the money to pay that credit card. I have that money now, and I was able to eat today because of you. I don't even know if you're a Pisces or if you're even going to see this, but I'll let you know that I talked about you in this Pisces reading because you helped me so tremendously. You're now my Facebook friend, too, and I just can't thank you enough for all the love and support. You always chime in into every reading, and that is abundance to me. Your words, your kindness, your support, encouragement, that helps me get out of this in my mind and in my heart. Even though we got fiat currency, you know, <laughs> we got God money. You know, this is where I'm at spiritually. Even though I feel like this with, with the fiat cash, the system money, I got God money. And so this is how I keep seeing that. It's through you guys. It's blessing me. And so I can't thank you enough. This is a means to an end. God will bless us through other people so if you have it on your heart to send in a tip or a donation please do you can just go to D's Divine Tarot 411 at gmail and ask me for a reading um, I do phone I do um, video chat and or I can make you a video but all in all this is hurting for money and holding on to your security very tightly next card we got uh oh is the devil okay Pisces so this is tied to, this is either a relationship that's tied to a devil, tied to the devil, or this is a couple, like, going to an extreme. You're probably, if it's an extreme, it's like anything from drinking to drugs to work. Work can be even going to an extreme. That's how me and my queen were with our alternative astronomy and astrology channel. We were pushing, 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 working, 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 trying to get the work out because it's humongous knowledge and wisdom. And so you can do anything to an extreme. So this could be your relationship or this could be even a devilish couple around you causing problems. All in all, we'll get more clarity, but this is someone tied to the devil and it's time to cut yourself free 
from this devil and from the extremities or from those devilish ways. Okay, so you got some major arcanas here. These are both major arcanas, and this is what God is getting you, breaking you away from real fast. You won't be dealing with this devil, and especially when you got this queen of wands. She, she, she's so magical. This devil won't stand a chance. <laughs> okay, next card we got. Whoa! Now we know where you're going. This is the eighth cup. You're going to the tenth cup, the happily ever after with your queen of abundance and fire and spirit is going to bless this and take you to her fast Ooh, we pisces y'all doing it right you know what you're missing you're missing your queen and this life right here this is your life pisces next card yep seven of pentacles so yep right here these are both showing you the same thing he's penny pinching holding on tight with everything he got to his uh, uh his money his value his worth and this is someone who stacked up a lot a lot of pentacles and still not seeing their worth so we got to balance this out y'all go into your spiritual nature and get out of the material world mindset because this will hold you back and block your blessings this is a blocking your blessings card because you're too tight too hold holding on to whatever you're holding on to for whatever reasons let your arms go do like this and get ready to receive because god got everything you need coming right to you you can't lose pisces you're all winners. Y'all, one of the best signs I do readings for. Y'all always got beautiful readings. Y'all beautiful, balanced people. And look what you got. This queen. And this queen is about to get her king. I love it. We got neighbors next door. Next card we got is the two of pentacles. So this two. Sorry, y'all. They're a little loud, but... This Two of Pentacles is all about balance, and it shows that's what you've been doing. This is why you're getting out of Dodge. <laughs> Look at these Pentacles here. <laughs> we got the Two, we got the Four, and then we got the Seven. <laughs> and you're juggling, you know. You're getting all this work done, probably home life, work life, you know. Probably got other things going. But you are very valuable. You know you're valuable, but you're not seeing your worth. So just trust spirit. Go into your spiritual nature and open up. I got a song called um, Give, Receive, and Open Up. This is what you need to do. I'll, I'm going to actually share that on the channel for you guys. Uh, it was done some years ago, but I love that song still to this day. And this is what we have to do. We have to give, receive, and open up. Okay? So get ready to do that and get ready for your blessings coming in Pisces this is gonna be the trade-off switcheroo baby <laughs> alright so that was the first card of the first the next six this is your home environment card oh my god y'all doing it so beautifully Pisces you got the justice card God is on your side God has your back this is justice in your favor from the Creator you can't lose so is this chariot coming to take you to this justice, which is your queen. Looks like you had to break free from a devilish relationship, be it a guy or a girl. But they put you here. You had to hold on to your security. You weren't seeing your worth in it. It was a bunch of juggling in this relationship. And God's like, oh, contraire, mon frere, this is over. You're getting ready to get out of Dodge and go and get what you're missing. <laughs> These other two cups. <laughs> God is so good. All right, next two cards. Uh, next card we got. This is all about the struggle. You putting in the work. You know, this is showing the challenges. You know, all the things you keep facing and you keep meeting those challenges. You keep meeting your responsibilities. You're handling your business and it's not enough anymore. This relationship has you all out of whack, having to fight, having to, you know, keep on giving your all and you're not seeing what you deserve, you're juggling and you're not seeing your worth, it got you all tied up and blocking your blessings. This is a devilish relationship, so it's time to break free. It looks like that's what God's going to help you do or you already did. And the next card is... Wow, looks like that's exactly what you did. You see all this abundance in the card? So this is all about a, a spiritual wish, a spiritual order. Um, that you put out to the universe, to the divine, and now that wish is coming in. So 
You see those ships at the bottom? They're not there yet, but they're coming in really, really fast. It could be the month of June. So this is all about something that you've manifested, something you've created, and it's time for this harvest to come in. And it looks like it's going to be this queen <laughs> or her king. <laughs> and justice in your favor for the best life happily ever after. <laughs> I love it. Okay, next card we got is... The Queen of Swords, wow. So this is a super balanced queen. She's super magical and she's all about the truth. You can't lose with this. This is an empress. Anytime you start to get multiple queens that's showing you she's an empress, she's super balanced, super magical. This is her truth. Uh, sword, so this is basically her filtering system for BS. Anytime somebody, anytime somebody's gonna come up to her with any kind of nonsense, any kind of drama, she's gonna cut it out because she knows her work. She doesn't play. This one doesn't sell for fools, and she will chop a fool down real quick with her tongue, or be it that sword with the truth and let him know. Oh, contraire, move frere, not over here. Skedaddle. <laughs> I love it. So. Is that the last? Oh, this is the last card, isn't it blue? It's the death of the devil in your life. Holy smokes, Pisces. You brought the death to this devilish relationship, and it's a wrap. You chased this devil right out of your life. And now it's time for your justice. This is going to be your justice. This new wish coming in super fast from the divine gonna be both of these queens for her new king and a king for the, this this queen which is really an empress so you're an emperor coming in Pisces and this is your life <laughs> love it this is so beautiful it came in loverly and just get ready you know to have the best life ever I'm so proud of you for chasing this devil out of your life you got rid of it and now you can go right ahead and live happily ever after. Okay, so thank y'all so much, Pisces. I hope the reading helped. If you need more clarity, insight, and guidance, please check your moon, your rising, or your um, Venus sign. Or if you need, uh, I can do a private reading for, for you, be it a video chat, phone call, or I just send you a private uh, reading through YouTube, and only you can access the link when I send it to you, and you can send it to other people and watch it as many times as you like. But that's basically it. I appreciate y'all so much for letting me read for y'all. Let's give you some more of this beauty out here. Alright, and thank y'all so much for rocking with me. This is D with D's Divine Tarot 411. Blessings, blissfulness, peace and love. Bye y'all.